see the game more clearly with high definition spectacle lenses from Norville Opticians. Nick, um, team news obviously out. A couple of interesting changes, I suppose the most interesting one, um, given to the three England boys uh, a week's rest. Yeah, I mean, Johnny and Morgs especially, you know, they've, they've been involved with England the, the whole time over the, um, the, uh, the Autumn Internationals and sometimes it, you just need a little bit of a freshen up and, you know, they've, you know, they've both done really well for England and so we, we just felt give them a week off, freshen them up and because you know, sometimes it's not just the physical side, it's the mental side as well and, you know, four massive games and... So, yeah, it just gives them a little bit of a break and they'll come, you know, be fresh back for next week. Well, obviously, you know, Billy's catching the side this week and um, he's uh, he was desperate to come back and play and, and he hadn't, you know, he he came off the bench against Samoa and obviously started against Australia. So he probably hasn't had as much sort of game time as, as uh, Morgs and, um, you know, Johnny. So um, so Billy was desperate to keep, keep playing and keep going. So you know, he comes back in and, and yeah, he's going to lead the side. And Shane Monahan, obviously, and uh, Charlie Sharples on the wings. I mean, th there is still plenty of experience in that three-quarter line, isn't there? And, and Henry Purdy uh, at, uh, at outside centre, which is a position which he's, you know, sort of <clears throat> probably not favoured at the start of the season, but is certainly impressed in. Yeah, well, obviously, when Henry Trinder got injured, you know, um, Henry Purdy came in and and did really well at thirteen. So, um, it's. You know, we we want to have that pace. We want to give Henry a, uh, Purdy a chance at 13 again because he we moved him back to the wing when we we had obviously internationals not available in the injuries. So, but that sort of combination of Hooky Billy and and Purds was going well. So, we want to go back to it and see how it goes. Um, and it gives a chance to give Shane a run. He, you know, Shane's had a few injuries so far this season and hasn't been able to get too much game time. So it's important to give him a run and see how he goes and. And yeah, so you know, we, we've people are coming back from injury, and we've got a few options and coming back from international. So it just gives us a chance to just field a few different sort of um, combinations. Looking at the pack, I suppose the one thing that really stands out there, Aleki Latui, um, with his with his first start, and, and probably very much deserved. Yeah, Leckie's done really, really well. You know, he's a very experienced campaigner, and and <clears throat> he's got you know he's got amazing attitude and. He runs around like a 25-year-old, and he's just brilliant. Brings great attitude to, to the team, great physicality, great skills. So, um, you know, he's waited his time, and I'm really pleased. You know, I we're really pleased for him. And you know, Hibbs, Hibbs is you know having a bit of a week off just to sort of get and on to regenerate. Um, but Lecky deserves it, and yeah, uh, you know, he's he's a fantastic player, and so very experienced, and brings a lot to us. So, yeah, really really pleased for them, for Lecky. Zebra. So, back-to-back -back games in Europe, do you approach them any differently to how you would approach a team that you won't play for another few weeks? Um, no, not really. All it does is it means the second game is much easier to analyse because you know what's coming, you, you know, you, you, you've done all the analysis this week and then it'll just be a bit of fine-tuning next week. But, you know, we've looked, you know, we're taking this game extremely ser seriously. We want to do really well in this competition. Um, you know, we're going as full strength as we can at the moment and um, we, we want to get a good performance against Zebra. You know, they're, they're a good side, they've got some good quality players and some internationals and so we're not taking this lightly at all. We want to get a really good performance and, and um, you know, try and push on in this competition.